Welcome to Research and Analysis. My name is Dr. Kamran and in today's tutorial I'm going to tell you about the difference between mediated moderation and moderated mediation models. So this is the simple mediation model. We have like one IV, one DV and in between we have mediator. So this is just a simple mediation model. Then we have simple moderation model in which we have one IV and DV and in between there is a moderator. And finally we have moderated mediation or mediated moderation model. They are actually drawn in the same way as far as this picture is concerned they are just same. Just by looking at you can't tell anybody that whether we have moderated mediation or mediated moderation model. Like if we talk about moder moderated mediation, it could be a first stage moderated mediation model or it could be a mediated moderation model. So then the question is how we can uh, conclude that whether we have moderated mediation or mediated moderation model. So, so the, the main difference uh, between moderated mediation and mediated moderation models is the theorizing. The way you theorize your uh, relationships, that will determine whether you have moderated mediation or mediated moderation. So let's first talk about mediated moderation models, the way how to theorize it. It actually consists of three steps. Uh, in first step, we theorize about the role of moderator between IV and DV. And then in second step, we theorize about role of moderator between IV and mediator. And in the final step, we actually theorize the impact of interaction term on our dependent variable via mediator. So this interaction term, actually the interaction term between IV and moderator and this and the impact of this interaction term on DV via mediator. If we are theorizing in these three steps, then we are actually having mediated moderation model. Now we will discuss about moderated mediation models, how to theorize it. It can also consist of three steps. In first step, we theorize about our indirect effect the impact of our IV on DV via mediator. So in second step, we will actually examine the impact of IV on mediator, how this relationship will be influenced by having a moderator. And in the final step, the third step, we will theorize about how the indirect effect of IV on DV via mediator is influenced by the moderator. So in fact, we are considering that the indirect impact, indirect impact of our IV on DV via mediator, this whole relationship is actually function of our moderator. So if we are theorizing by using these three steps, then this means that we are having moderated mediation model. If you will have any further question regarding these two kind of models, you can write in your in the comments of this video. Thanks for watching.